New this morning, two men are behind bars in New Mexico accused of smuggling children across the border. New Mexico State Police say on May 29th, an officer pulled over an SUV on I-25 near Las Cruces after noticing passengers in the back seat were not wearing seat belts. During that stop, the officer found 11 undocumented immigrants inside the vehicle, along with a 5-year-old and 11-year-old girl. Police say the children's mother lives in Mississippi and paid 23-year-old Antonio Guerra Garcia and 40-year-old Saul Rojas Villa to drive the girls across the border. After entering the U.S., Garcia and Villa were supposed to let the children turn themselves into Border Patrol in El Paso, but investigators say the men didn't allow the girls to leave and kept driving north into New Mexico. Garcia and Villa were booked into the Doniana County Detention Center and are now facing kidnapping and child abuse charges. The children were turned over to U.S. Border Patrol and taken to El Paso with plans to be reunited with their mother.